Hey, what's going on guys? Apple Orchard here, and today, Apple has released the third beta of iOS 17.4. In this video, I'll be showing you what is new inside of the software. And on my iPhone 14 Pro right here, it came in at 6.82.3 megabytes. So yeah, let's get started. We got a couple of things we gotta talk about today. All right, so the first thing is inside Safari. If we go into here, and then we go to a new tab right here, you're gonna see the tab bar layout has been reverted back. So it's the same thing as iOS 17.3 now. It looks just as nice as it did there. I think it looks better now. And I did not like the, how it was stretched out a bit. I'm glad I was reverted back in this beta. Now the next thing is inside of the podcast app. So if I go into podcasts right here, you're gonna see we got that new splash screen right there. And if I go into a podcast right here and wait a bit, before in iOS 17.2, this would just disappear automatically. Well, now we actually gotta just scroll. Let me just turn that off. And you're gonna see it won't disappear until we actually do this. So you're gonna see it now the searching is, and uh, now that something I've been asking for in the podcast app is when you scroll up, you now are able to get the player back. So that's a pretty good change inside of iOS 17.4 beta three. Now, I was not able to cover some Beta 2 stuff. I'm so sorry about that. I was pretty sick last week, so I'm once again pretty sorry I could not do a video about iOS 17.4 Beta 2. But yeah, if we go inside of Settings, General, and then About, and go into here, we have a D at the end of the build number, which means Apple has compiled this build four times. They found a bug, they fixed it, they found a bug, they fixed it, they found a bug, they fixed it, they found a major bug, and they fixed it. Keep in mind that's only with major bugs, really like stuff that will prevent the phone from being usable and we only had that four times so that's a good sign about how smooth ios 17.4 is now what can we expect the next beta so once again i'm gonna say next week if we go into the calendar actually no let's do something different and go into this calendar right here i would expect the next beta here on the 20th and then the next thing that would come out is the RC, which I would expect here on the 27th. And then next, I would expect iOS 17.4 to come out to everyone after the RC comes out. And that, I would say, would be on March 4th on this Monday right here. So that is when I would expect the next betas and the next final release of iOS 17.4. I don't think we're getting any more point updates this time around. It just seems way too unlikely. But yeah, there weren't many changes inside this latest beta, just a couple of improvements. And overall, it feels a lot better. And something I would like to mention is if we go into here, and then we do this, this is smooth, so... Very nice that that is all smooth and everything. If you're wondering where this calendar widget is, it's my app Wikipedia. You can download it down in the description down below. And also I have another app called StudyRect, which is a free studying app that you can just download and start studying right away. And I'll have a macOS video up as soon as possible. And thanks for watching, comment, like, subscribe, share this with your friends, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye everyone, I love you all. <laughs>